Hello and welcome to Watch Along with me, Disco Dan. Today we'll be taking a look back at one of my favourite matches from last October, the Halloween Street Fight. So it is myself, Rave Boy and Miss Massive, Jessica Logan, Massive Disco Rave, taking on the three kings of Owen Ocean, Mike Angelo and Geridon. So here we are in the ring. Um, Jessica has dressed up as a king for the match, claiming she is the fourth king, which got an interesting chant of four king. I won't say any more. Um, so yeah, here we go. Bell has just rang. Uh, Jessica offering a handshake. We want a fair contest here, even though there's no rules and we can do whatever we want to each other. So. Well, I mean, except the handshake is the question. He does. Ooh, cheap shot. Ah, he pulls off her fake hand there. And they overreact ridiculously. And then we all get to work just hitting each other because it's a street fight. We're not starting with holds. Jessica hitting Owen with her fake hand there. Anything goes here, remember. Yeah, we've all kind of paired off, sending Mike into Owen and then send Gerridan in as well. Got them all stacked up in the corner. There go. Sending Rave Boy in, huge splash. Drops down. Gonna send Massive in. This one is going to be massive, as I say. Big splash there from Jessica. And going into me, pick him up. And good old fashioned airplane spin, one of my favourite moves to do, although it does as much bad to me as it does to them, because honestly, I get so busy. It's unbelievable. And I seem to keep going on and on and on there. So, I don't know why the camera's focused on Rave Boy here. It's kind of missing, it was throwing a sheet over Owen to make him look like a ghost, which scared Mike, which we did completely miss there. Then Geridon comes in. He ain't afraid of no ghost. You know what he is afraid of? Spiders. We have to do a bit of comedy at the start. It's what people like from us. So we had a lot of fun there. And then, time for a Halloween dance break so I have muted it here just so we don't get a copyright claim uh, but it is Ghostbusters playing as we have a little dance around have a bit of fun before we get down to some more serious business. What I am amazed by is that my wig has stayed on up until this point uh, so we all went out got some witch's broomsticks to dance with well we were meant to. Two of us got witch's broomsticks. Rave Boy couldn't find one, so we ended up with a random pinata stick as we danced round. Acting like idiots, which is always good fun. Oh, there we go. Oh, they're pulling us out of the ring. Oh, three on two beat down. And I'm pretty sure here she comes, Jessica going up. The screams massive, witch's broom and flies onto everyone. And that is where I lost the wig, which I, like I said, was amazed it stayed on for that long. Um, so we all take one of the kings each, give them a bit of a beating. Great boy. Scratching him and hitting him with a fake hand. There's Jessica tickling Mike with a feather boa. And then me just laying it into I win there. Smack his head off a chair. A brave boy. Taking out Geridon. Let's go! 
So, I'm not sure what Gary has got on his head there, to be honest, but he's got something. And off he goes, reverses Rave Boy, and shots the back with Owen's trident. Big drop kick. Not sure where I am at this point. I think I was thrown into the ring post. <laughs> but yeah. Bit of two on one against Rave Boy there. Here comes Mike. So choking Rave Boy in the corner with his trident there. Here I come, trying to get back in. Mike knocks me off. Trying to use the numbers game to the advantage there. They want to finish this early. I've sent Mike to get a weapon. Looking for it. What's he got? He's got a boot by the looks of it. I think it's meant to be like a witch's leg. Not really too sure there. Owen taking out Jessica. These guys, normally they do have the numbers advantage, but in a fair fight, we tend to beat them. Well, they have beaten us as well, but it was three on two when they beat us. Great boy trying to fight back. Take him out again there. Got big plans with this boot. Oh, that couldn't have felt good. Mike taking a boot to where the sun don't shine. And then Rave Boy taking Gerridan out there. Like the Kings are trying to regroup. We're not going to give them a chance. Jessica's gone to get some pumpkins because it's Halloween street fight. What's a Halloween street fight without pumpkins? So, got Mike in the corner, got a pumpkin each, and it's time, some pumpkin bowling. Ooh. Second one. That can't have felt good. It was a big one, she's got the biggest pumpkin, the massive pumpkin if you will. Oh, that's four shots he's taken there now. And then, oh, Owen's in. Just hit Jessica with a chair. And now Gary does go in. Big chair shots to the back. Honestly say that was the first chair shot I ever took after 10 years of, since I first started training. And honestly, it hurts. Don't care what anyone says, you get smacked in the back with a steel chair, it hurts. So, um, me and Owen are fighting into the back at the moment there. Mike smacking Jessica's head off the post. And um, it all kind of gets missed, but me and Owen have fought backstage. And while we were backstage, he took a trash can and absolutely pelted me with it. And then left me back there. So Owen comes back out with his mangled trash can and the Kings have got the advantage three on two at this point. So Owen taking Jessica out. All three Kings now left alone with Rave Boy. Jessica fighting back there. She, she ain't going down. Trash can to Owen. Right, that's bad. The Kings have taken control here. They have got the numbers advantage with me taken out backstage. Left Jessica and Rave Boy. Three on two against the Kings there with weapons involved. It's not a good place to be. And Gerrida sent Mike to get the thumbtacks 
this. Not going to end well. Bag of tacks there. Or so he thought. We've got some very bad intentions with these thumbtacks, but empties them out. And it's not thumbtacks. <laughs> he got the bags mixed up. And it's a bag of sweets. Which I didn't land on the sweets, but I can't imagine it was that nice. I mean, they were hard sweets. Probably like landing on Lego. And we all know what it's like when you stand on some Lego. But here they go. Let's double suplex him. No. Fights back. He comes Owen. Both boy stops him. Scoops him up. Big slam on the sweets. Does not look like that was pleasant. Now he's going for it. We all love it. Everybody's favourite fish related move. It is the silly salmon. Ooh, how we moved out of the way. Rave boy landing on the sweets there. Jessica's trying to get back up, trying to get back in it. the gut, boots the back. Lowen takes out Rave Boy in the ring. It's not looking good for us here. That is Trident. Ooh. He was firmly in control. Not what we were hoping for at all there. Double team and Rave Boy there for the Witch's Broom. Big shot to Rave Boy there. What's he selling him for? It's that chair. Mike sending Jess back in the ring there as well. We've got some bad intentions here. chairs there. Only I'm badly. But here I am. I'm back. I saved my team there. Go to know him. Both go for weapon shots. Knock them both down. Put them back. What am I looking for? It's got a Halloween pinata. Straight off of Owen's head there. Regroup the team, we can get back in this. Mike's got the pinata, but I'm not letting him do that. Right off his head. Rave Boy wants to go. Another shot to the head. Now we're going to finish this. Going for the finisher. Still need a name for this move. As I hooked it up, my response was on a chair? <laughs> so I was not expecting it. We are the chair, we're going for the pin, but Gerridan breaks it up. Chair shot to the back. That was not pleasant. Lilith didn't even go down for the count there because as soon as she was moving in, she saw the chair coming and I don't blame her for getting out of the way at all there. Here comes Jessica with the, the, the bat, the pinata stick. She's going to take them both out there. Goes sending Garridan out the ring. He's firing up. He's going to go for it. He loves this. And she goes for a Dorito kick. And oh, I couldn't see it, but Owen pulled. Gerridan out the way there, so Jessica has taken 
full force straight onto the floor there. Not good at all. But me and Reef boy still up. We've got Mike down. Send him for the table. Little tribute to the Dudley boys as well with Disco. Get the table. Get rid of all the pumpkins. And get the table into the ring. Guy next to me went, that looks a bit flimsy. But I can say, even though it was a decorating table, going through one of them is painful. But we'll get to that shortly. Um, here we go, setting Mike up. Mike gets down, shoves Rave Boy into me. Rave Boy head first into a chair there. I'm not going down, fighting back. I'm going to win this. Okay. But out of nowhere, 3D through a table. Can honestly say that sucked. But three kings pick up the win there, unfortunately. Um, afterwards, I got backstage and realised I had a massive graze the inside of my arm. Not sure what happened. Um, still had the adrenaline running, so it didn't feel too bad until the next morning where I realised my left arm <laughs> didn't work. But I am very proud of that match. It may have hurt, but it's the only time that I've ever been in the conversation for match of the year at House of Pain. So I am so proud of that match. Absolutely loved it with the exception of being hit with chairs and going through a table. <laughs> but other than that, it it was fun. So yeah, hope you guys all enjoyed it as well. Uh, let me know what you thought. Leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you again next time for some more watching along or jive talking with me, Disco Dan.